Hello everyone, this is Krishna from Exolade. I'm going to give you a sneak preview of version 1.1 of Exolade. We're super excited about this release. Three main things that I'm going to talk about in this video. First, we simplified the drawing tools interface. This will make it easier for you to draw multiple drawings on the screen. Two, we've added the ability to record reviews as part of the video. So anything that you draw and say will be recorded as part of that review. And finally, we've added search capability to the app, so you can quickly locate videos using different search terms. Let's see how it all looks. The first thing you'll notice is that the drawing button has been moved away from the top panel to it being right here. This is actually a floating button, so you can place it anywhere that you want on the screen. The other big change is that if you want to select a drawing, you know, as before, you would tap on the drawing type, but the drawing doesn't appear on the screen as in the previous version. You have to actually drag your finger on the screen for the drawing to appear. We think that this will make it very easy for you to select multiple drawings and draw them very quickly, like I'm showing now. To erase your drawing, simply hit the eraser button and then select all the drawings that you want to erase. Please give these drawing buttons and the changes we've made a try and let us know what you think. We look forward to your feedback. The other big feature that we've added as part of Exolate 1.1 is the ability to record reviews. To record a review, simply hit the record button at the very top of the screen, and then everything that I say and draw will be recorded as part of that review. Let's see how it would look for this athlete's technique if I were to review it. So this athlete, as he's trying to hit the base, you'll notice that his left leg is actually pointed really high up, when in fact, it should be pointed towards the base so that he can stand up on it and steal a base if uh, you know that opportunity exists. So now let's see how that review looks. So this athlete, as he's trying to hit the base, you'll notice that his left leg is actually pointed really high up, when in fact, it should be pointed towards the base so that he can stand up on it and steal a base if uh, you know that opportunity exists. So now let's see how that review looks. So. Hopefully that gives you a sense of how easy it is to record a review for any video. And once the video is saved, the review is saved, you can easily share it with your athlete by simply hitting the upload button and then hitting the share button to select the person that you want to share it with. We're really excited by this new feature and we hope that you'll give it a try and let us know what you think. And the final feature that I want to show you today is the ability to search for videos by entering simple search terms. To search, simply hit the search button at the very top of the screen and enter it. You can search by title, layer name, notes, or even event information. So let's say that I want to look for all batting videos. I simply enter that term and the video appears. Now let's say that I want to look for videos with a specific uh, player's name. So as you can see, all the videos with the player name Harry have shown up in this listing. To select the video, simply hit on the thumbnail and then that video is available for playback. So that's all we have for you as version 1.1. There are a bunch of other usability and uh, you know, improvements that we've added to the app, and we're really excited about the changes we've made to version 1.1. Please give it a try and let us know what you think. Thanks.